Every night this month, RTV6 is taking a trip down memory lane as we prepare for the station's 70th anniversary on May 30th. Channel 6 signed on as the state's first TV station on May 30th, 1949. Our call letters at the time, WFBM. Well, tonight we share a memory from one of Channel 6's earliest employees. This is one of photographer Dick Baldwin's rare appearances on TV back in 1958. But you saw his history-making pictures for years. He joined the station in 1957 as WFBM's first full-time photographer. He was 20 years old at the time. 20 years later, in 1977, he was on the scene in downtown Indianapolis to bring viewers jaw-dropping pictures of Tony Karitsis kidnapping mortgage broker Richard Hall at gunpoint and holding him hostage. There was a man le uh, walking with another man, and there was, he was holding a shotgun on the back of the man's head. I walked along, but on the other side of the street, and photographed. We got down to Illinois and Washington, and uh, Mr. Hall tripped, and Tony Karitsis almost fell on top of him, and I could not imagine how that gun did not go off. Mr. Kritzis commandeered the police car and put Mr. Hall in the car and drove off, and so I flagged down an automobile, and it turned out it was a salesman from out of town, and I asked him if he would follow that car, and so he had no idea what was going on, of course, but we followed that car out to an apartment building. Uh, Carissus held Hall hostage for 63 hours with the sawed-off shotgun wired to his neck. It all ended after the prosecutor told Carissus he would be granted immunity. But as soon as he released Hall, Carissus was arrested. He spent several years in a mental institution before his release. He died in 2005. Hall wrote a book about this experience that came out two years ago.